Okay, so came back to do some more laundry. Wow. Holy hell, this one's really stacked. Is that one? Is that one? I think it. We can go through this way. Back to the hospital. Hmm? Huh? What? Huh? What? 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 It's too bright out here. What is that? Who are you? Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? <laughs> and our friends back New here. Who is? New family. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. <laughs> Delayed. <laughs> I'm going to the Doyle. See you. We're trying goodies again. Wish us luck. It's open. All right, so they also got a log book. So per usual, we're gonna go 5.30. Gadget. So, it kind of looks like a soap, right? And that looks like a mountain range. They timbered it off. Sure. Sam, so I'm probably like right. Like right here, maybe. Good morning. Uh, we had quite the group of hikers at the hostel last night, kind of outdoorsy. Uh, it was me, soap, sassafras, P-Rex, diner, barista, um, Milwaukee, polo, um, six foot, Looney Tunes, Vista, and Kit Kat. Uh, so, so much fun. Class caught up yesterday, and um, today she's waiting for a package from UPS. So. We're not leaving um, until we get that package, so we've got loads of time today because we have no idea when it's gonna arrive. Um, plus, she did two 24 mile days to catch up with us, so um, she's gonna wanna relax a little bit. So I've decided, and I wish I had decided this earlier, to wash my sleeping bag. Soap has already washed his sleeping bag and it turned out pretty well. So, and I was a little bit worried to wash mine, but mine is very dirty. It's so gross and this is like what goes by my face and if you know me, I'm very careful with my face and my skincare. So we're gonna go see and hope it doesn't ruin the sleeping bag. I am so nervous, wish me luck. Uh, it's been nice seeing so many hikers, um, especially since we've had like a weird period where we haven't seen very much. So we're meeting loads of new people and I love it. This is the old train station. Let's go see what's over here. Oh, wow. That's beautiful. That is crazy. Uh, I just have to say, I have nothing but good things to say about uh, kind of outdoorsy, the hostel. I've been loving it here. Um, mood has been boosted. I think I needed that zero day. Um, and I'm ready to start hiking again and see what else is out there. Uh, it's great to have Sass back. Um, I love seeing all the small towns and I'm pretty sure we're about to hit um, Rocksylvania, which is just like a bunch of frickin' rocks and we're gonna probably be hating ourselves <laughs> after the first day because I'm pretty sure it starts right after this town. Uh, I've been hearing it's through here, New Jersey and New York um, and I do have a friend from England coming to visit me soon um, so I'm very excited for that and for all of you to meet her and for her to just be enveloped by the hiking community and uh, I believe she's gonna be out here for two weeks so I'm super excited for that.
Oh, it's like, a, it's a double bridge. You see that? So there's this beautiful one here, and then there's also this one right there. So pretty. Love, 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 love. I'm also really liking these old historic buildings. Like you can obviously tell like this one's kind of been redone, but this used to be the old train station and this was a train stop at one point, um, bringing goods and services to the town of Duncannon. Such a beautiful day. Okay, now it's drying. Yikes. All right, I did realize that resupply in this town isn't so good. They do have the Quick Mart. Uh, they do have a Carnes, I think it's called, um, but it's not really that close to trail. Um, but I had to grab a few allergy pills because the fields of the last day have just been eating at my allergies. Um, but I got enough to just go to the next town so I can buy a whole bottle of allergy medicine. Um, but the hostel kind of outdoorsy has a really good resupply, so I didn't really have, I didn't really have to worry about much just to get me to the next town, which I think is Port Clinton. <laughs> sleeping bag around town. Hey, do you need 12 flags? Uh, yeah, why, where? What? I don't read, I have a guy. Oh, the truck. You have a guy? Yeah. Damn. <laughs> All right, so Twizzler and Hobley um, messaged Sass on Instagram and basically offered to slack pass it, pack us for eight miles. So we're going to uh, out of the town of Duncannon. So they're gonna be here any minute and they are bringing um, little tiny backpacks. Um, apparently they watch our videos. So I'm very excited to meet them and slack pack to the next gap. Um, especially since we're leaving a little later, uh, we've been taking our time. We've been catching Sass up on Hunger Games, which has been kind of fun because she's never seen them. So we have one more movie to watch. Um, it did finish, yeah, um, and she enjoyed it. But um, we're excited, and we still have to pop by the post office to do a bounce box. So the three of us are bounce boxing stuff together. What are we doing? We're uh, hiking. Sweet, that's sweet. Hiking. These are the backpacks, of course. So pass blue. Sass got a cool blue and purple. A. <laughs> <laughs> for the record, I went on record that I was prepared to take the daisies. But you know, since Fresh Grounds called me Dirty Daisy, I get the dirty, I get the dirty daisy, I get the daisy one. <laughs> but uh, Twizzler and Hop of the Girl are amazing. Um, they recommended an ice cream place on the way to the post office, so now we're getting ice cream. I'm so glad I was recording. <laughs> Oh wow, that looks beautiful. It's called ice cream. <laughs> it's dairy, and then they put um, it in the freezer, and then now it's... That comes out of cows? Yes, this is a cow. Sure. Oh, yeah, let's go for it. We're sending soap out ahead because someone just told us behind us that there's a mama bear and three cubs. So, yeah, plus we want him to get eaten first and then we can, me and Sass can take pictures. So much fucking poison ivy everywhere. 
crazy. I love that I've just been walking through it. Wow. 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 Oh, that rock moves. Just so you know. Marshall. Yeah. He's talking to Soap about that. Yeah. Out of the bathroom. What do you think it is? Uh, I'm going to say it's. It's all this. Hi, bud. You're a long way from water. Wow. Look at him go. Right. Yeah, we stopped by there. I picked up a couple things. Right. Brandy. Look at the view. <laughs> Looking so cool. Climbed up that really hot, sweaty, like, in yours. And then that hill. Oh, yeah, the one that went straight up. Yeah. Was that right after we got the cold beverage from those people's parents? Yeah. 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 Yeah, it was rough. All right, so we're getting close to getting our bags back. And I just have to say that it felt really nice not having them coming out of town. Um, definitely a huge mood booster. Um, and an introduction to Rock Sylvania. Um, but I'm excited to get them and get to camp and set up for the night. I think we're about a half a mile away and I'm on snake duty, snake watch. And that's terrifying. I don't know why I signed up for this. Young lad. And just never got around to it. It was amazing. They are so sweet. Just had a really great experience um, with Twizzler and Hobbly Girl. They are just the sweetest people ever. Um, they slack packed our bags from um, kind of outdoorsy, uh, eight miles up to Peter's Mountain Road where they were and they were and they were there when we got there and they were doing trail magic for everyone which was so sweet. Took our trash, filled up our water, offered sodas and saved us some banana bread uh, which they had already handed out to all the other hikers that had passed through and sat there for some much needed conversation and company from them. Um, super, super sweet people. We could have sat there all night talking to them. Um, he, his name is Twizzler because he loved Twizzlers and her name is Hobbly Girl is because uh, she was out hiking and I believe she tore her meniscus and when, um, I think it was her daughter or son, I'm sorry, I don't remember, but one of them texted Twizzler and said, how's our Hobbly Girl doing? And so that's how she got that nickname. Uh, I think it fits both of them. There's such such sweet human beings and they're also huge fans of our channel and it's just so humbling i don't even care that people watch our channel it's the fact that people in this community want to meet us and meet me and uh, i'm just i'm just hiking the trail i don't know what i'm doing out here um but i honestly can't do it without the community um couldn't do today without twizzler and hobbly girl uh definitely helped my transition out of town and back on trail without my bag and um, some of the rock scrambles were crazy so I'm glad I didn't have my bag. Um, sad to leave them um, but they're gonna be following along we're gonna be keeping in touch and just I uh, thank you so much Twizzler and Hobby Girl we wish you guys the best and thank you I mean thank you again and again and a hundred times again. It's honestly people like you that make this journey worth it. <sighs> Today was absolutely beautiful. I'm happy to have Sass back and we're gonna be having some other faces pop up shortly, which I'm very excited to have them back in the group. 
So Pennsylvania so far, I, lo I love it. So, so far top states are Virginia whoa, and Pennsylvania. Um, I'm even loving the rock scrambles. <laughs> um, I may hate myself later for saying it because I know it gets worse, <laughs> but um, so far so good. Okay, I think they see something really cool. <laughs> it's me, I'm really cool. They're all red and I'm not sure why. That is fucking beautiful. So pretty. Just beautiful. They did go inside, I thought, thank you. Oh, we like that. See the sunlight. All right, Sasha said, oh my gosh. So I'm assuming this view is really cool. She's filming cool. something. Wow. wow, this is beautiful. Shame for the electric pylon in the way, but it's still amazing. Still beautiful. Beautiful, but I would, yeah, I wish there was campsites here. Wow. We can stay here, we have headlamps. You think he's sensitive about his fuzziness? I don't know, maybe. He's on my tent. You're in his forest. Okay, but. <laughs> Should I smack him? No, I'm scared. Like, how fuzzy is he? Like, fuzzy was he was a bear. Fuzzy was I mean, he had no hair? Yeah, except this one has a lot of hair. Is it possible that he's hot? Bah! <laughs> Guess who's back? I'm back again. My moth fuzzy friends. Moth. Fuzzy moth. Fuzzy <laughs> moth. Please don't tell your friends. <laughs> fuzzy moth. Fuzzy moth. Fuzzy moth. Fuzzy moth. Fuzzy moth. <laughs> Get off my tent. He's just chilling. No, I don't want him there. Sponsored by.